So one of the problems in chapter 12 has to do with measuring how much of a substance can be solubilized in water. So the, how much goes into water in terms of solubility really depends on the intermolecular forces. So here we have um, four molecules, oxygen gas, which is nonpolar, lithium chloride, which is ionic, bromine, Br2, diatomic gas, just like oxygen, is also nonpolar. It's just smaller because Br2, in, by its position in the periodic table, is more towards the noble gas side. So it's a little bit more smaller than oxygen. That's the difference between nonpolar diatomic O2 versus nonpolar diatomic bromine, the size and also what the textbook calls polarizability. And then finally, we have methanol. So obviously that OH group implies hydrogen bonding. So uh, when methanol hydrogen bonds to itself, it can also hydrogen bond to the water. So that hydrogen bonding effect gives it a greater chance that it will go in. So this is also about miscibility, mixing, right? So methanol will mix in to water much better because of hydrogen bonding potential. So the problem here is asking us for increasing. So this is probably gonna be last on our list. Second uh, would be uh, lithium chloride, right? So lithium chloride uh, is an ionic compound. It will solvate. Once you put lithium chloride in water, it will solvate and dissociate into its component ions of lithium ion, positive charge, and chloride ion, negative charge. So it really has competing forces here between ionic and hydrogen bonding. Um, so increasing solubility of water, um, you know, this would be last. Hydrogen bonding will win over something that's uh, ionic, though lithium chloride is very strong. The intermolecular forces of lithium chloride are much stronger than um, the methanol, methanol hydrogen bonding, or the methanol water hydrogen bonding. Uh, but in terms of water solubility, uh, methanol would be the most soluble, uh, lithium chloride would be the second most soluble, and then Br2, um, because of its size, it could probably squeeze in to the water molecule, and so when we're gas solubility in water, size makes a difference. So Br2 will be third most soluble, oxygen gas will be least soluble. So going from increasing solubility, what I just mentioned was uh, decreasing solubility. So increasing solubility, this would be least soluble, the oxygen, maybe we'll call that one. Uh, Br2, because of size, uh, will be next soluble in water. Uh, lithium chloride, ionic, methanol, hydrogen bonding, it kind of is a toss up. Here, water will probably split the individual ions. I would call this number three. And then methanol, uh, because the hydrogen bonding occurs between methanol and methanol and methanol and water, more hydrogen bonding interactions, so more of it can go into water. So this would be the most soluble, and the least soluble would be oxygen gas.